What's going on guys, it's Grant and I'm back with another video. Now today, as you guys can see, we have my friend Matt. What's Say what's good? up? <laughs> Today, as you guys can tell from the title of this video, we're going to be showing you guys our pickups that we've gotten from the past couple of months. Matt brought all of his pickups over and they're right next to us here. And then of course, I'm going to be showing you guys my pickups. So it's basically just going to be a big haul, sneakers, clothing, accessories. So stay tuned. I'm going to go first and show you guys my pickups and then Matt's going to show you guys his. So with all that talking out of the way, make sure to follow us both on Instagram and subscribe. The links will be down below. Let's hop into my pickups first right now. Okay, so first up for my pickups, we got this Travis Scott disc right here. Believe it or not, this took four months to get here. I bought it back in October and it got here about a month ago. Um, it was like 20 bucks, so not too bad. I don't have something that can play this though, so I think I'm just gonna frame it. Maybe put it up here so it's in the background of the videos. Not too sure yet. First pickup, nothing too crazy. A little Travis Scott disc. Next up, we got a couple vintage shirts that I copped at Boston Got Soul. If you guys didn't watch that video, I'll put a link down below, but I told you guys that I copped some shirts and I didn't want to show you guys them yet. So I'm going to be showing you guys them now. First up, we got this blue and white tie-dye tee. It says double the trouble. Got the characters right there. I really like the back too. It has a circle like kind of pattern. I actually got all three of these shirts for 40 bucks. I think he was selling them for like 20 each. Um, but we made a little deal, I got three of them, and he gave me a little discount. Next up, we got this Ryan Newman racing tee. It says Ryan Newman there with the car. This is a really cool shirt, and it matches well with the Travis Scott 4s. And then the third shirt, another racing shirt here. We got this black and red Gordon tee, and then on the back, number 24, another race car on the back. This one's just pretty cool. I like that it has a little oversized boxy fit to it. And next up, we got a pair of jeans. These are actually custom made from this guy on Instagram. They took about a month to get here just because they were custom made. You had to select the size and then he would make them custom to your size basically so it took about a month to get here and as you guys can see they're like cargo jeans so they have all the pockets on the side um, unfortunately they don't fit me too well um, they're a little bit tight so I'm not sure what I'm gonna do with them yet they got the straps and everything <laughs> the straps are pretty long on the back um, so I don't know what I'm gonna do with these yet what do you think about these Matt uh, it's definitely something different. I'm not really a big fan of them, but it's something different. All right, so next up we got a crazy pickup. I know Matt likes this one. I love this one. We got the Cactus Plant Flea Market Nike hockey jersey. As you guys can see there, it says Air Sunshine, with the Air being in the up-tempo um, font. As you guys might know, this is what you guys can see on the up-tempos. Moving on to the back, you got Air Sunshine with this cool little design right there. I just love this jersey, honestly. You got the little mesh with the Nike and then the CPFM for Cactus Plant Flea Market. Big Nike logo here. This actually is like the exact same green that I dipped my Travis Scott's in, so that would be a really good fit. Another Nike logo there. I love this one, Matt. What do you think about this one? Yeah, this is so sick. It's probably one of the best things that he picked up, if not the best, yeah. because it's just so sick and you don't really see you don't really see many people with this. It's just something different and really cool. Yeah, and also after I got this, the prices on StockX went up about a hundred bucks. So I'm glad I was able to get this because this thing goes for like 400 bucks now. A lot for a jersey, um, but honestly, I think it's worth it. Not a lot of people have this. Let's move on to the last one right now. All right, and then for the last pickup, we got a pair of Sui Coke Moto slides right here. As you guys can see, they got the straps. And these are just really cool. I got these about two months ago, but I realized that I never showed you guys them, so might as well do it in this video. Um, they are really comfortable and they're a little expensive for slides. Um, they go for around like 150 to 200. And I know a lot of people probably don't like them because they look like hospital shoes. <laughs> I really do like them. They look good with pants, shorts, really anything. I'm definitely gonna wear these a lot in the summertime. Not much else to say, they're just black. They come in a lot of different colors, but I thought black would be the best just because it goes with a lot of things. Now Matt's gonna show you guys all of his pickups. He got a lot more stuff than I did, and I think a lot better stuff, but you guys can be the judge of that. Leave a comment down below after you're done watching the video. Whose pickups did you like more? Matt's gonna show you guys his right now. All right, so this is my first thing I picked up. They're just a clean pair of white and black Air Force Ones. I'm trying to like keep them like white for the summer because I'm not trying to have dirty shoes. Can't crease them. Too yeah, much. can't crease them too much. Like they're not even creased. Wanted to switch it up a bit, have the black swoosh on it, and it looks pretty sick. Next, we got the PG4s. I really don't have much to say about these. Like I literally got them a week or two ago. Already really beat up. I've I just played basketball in these. Pretty comfortable. So I actually would recommend picking them up because they're only 110. So sticking with basketball shoes, we got the KD12. Don C or these All Star, whatever you want to call them. And these are crazy. I got them for retail and they were going for like 210, so I thought I was like sick. I was like, 
Dude, I just got these for retail and they go for like under retail. But I don't even care. Like these are so sick. I love the colorway on this too. It's just like the Travis Fords, or like the UNC ones that I have. True, true. I love that baby blue. Or that oh yeah, I didn't even blue. think about that. It yeah. has like the red on the inside. Nice basketball shoe if you want to stand out a little on the court. So now onto the next shoe. We got these Jordan 1 uh, UNC to Chicago's or Chicago UNC's. They're actually a woman's shoe, but at Boston Got Soul where I got these, like it was all like women's like 13 and like women's 12s and stuff. So then I think I got like a men's 10. Yeah, 11. I think I got a woman's 13 or women's 13 and a half. These are really sick and they kind of remind me of like the top three ones that came out a few years ago. And I really wanted those, but the prices went way up. And this is a really good alternative. And I love this blue again, as you guys can tell from the KD-12s and the Travis 4s, off-white ones. Those are all like my favorite shoes in my collection. Would, yeah. you say, would you say blue, like if a shoe has that blue on it, it's, you're probably gonna like it? Yeah, I'm probably gonna like it. If I like the model and it has this blue on it, I'm probably gonna buy it. Okay, so next up, Matt's got a crazy pair. If you guys watched the Boston Got Soul video, you would have seen these, yeah. but he's gonna go into more detail about them. The Travis Scott Air Force ones. You guys have probably seen these a lot but had to pick them up. I love Travis as an artist and I love his shoes, definitely. Like they're all so sick, except for like maybe the Jordan like 32s or the whatever. 33s. 33s, yeah. Oh man. Those are trash, but everything else is fire, so had to pick them up. I just love them because there's so many different designs, colors, like materials, and it's just such a sick shoe and it's Travis, so, you know, gotta represent my boy. <laughs> and I'm actually not a big fan of this like zipper thing, but you can mm -hmm. just take it off. If you guys haven't seen these in person, then you might not know what I'm talking about, but all of these little panels have different materials, obviously different colors. Like you got the corduroy and the suede and the leather and everything about these is just super cool. I'm pretty much the same with Matt. I don't love this zipper too much, but obviously if you're gonna wear it, you can just take them off. And you got that gum sole too. Can't go wrong with that. All right, so before we go into the clothes, I actually got this. Supreme backpack from the SS20 drop. I got it for retail. I had to get the black one because it's the most simple. Yeah, I've been wearing it a lot recently. Definitely a good pickup. I use mine for school. I don't know if Matt's planning on using his for school, um, but you guys can see the mesh. Obviously the big Supreme logo. I'm not gonna wear it to school because I don't think I can fit all my binders in there, but maybe if I have like a half day, wanna go into Boston, like sneaker events, all that type of stuff. All right, so I got a couple clothing pieces right here. I'm just gonna start off with this off-white tee that I got at Ricardi's. It was on sale for what, like 50% 50 off? 50% off. It was 160 for this tee. It's really sick and simple, and that's what I like. Yeah, I really like this for like the summer and spring. Definitely gonna break this out. I've only worn it once so far, but definitely planning on wearing it more. Is this 3M? It looks uh, like yeah, it is 3M, a little bit, it's not oh, too much. That's really cool because obviously if you're taking a picture with Flash, then you can see the off-white logo. All right, so last thing out of all of our pickups, uh, we got this clothing piece right here, Asha World hoodie. I got it for 140. It was like 150 shipped. Then on the back right here, wish you were here. I remember this came out like the week before Asha World dropped. Mm. With all the obviously Travis did like the seven days I think it was um, of all the pre-orders and everything like that. I wish that I got this hoodie. Um, as you guys might be able to see, it's actually embroidered. The logo. Yeah, it's so sick. There's embroidered. all those different colors. This is probably the most like simple Asha World hoodie you can get. It's just. Asher World and on the back, wish you were here. So, mm -hmm. definitely one of the sickest Asher World pieces I could have gotten. So, happy I got this to add to the clothing collection. All right, guys, so that's gonna wrap it up for all of our pickups. We hope you guys enjoyed it. Leave a comment letting us know down below whose pickups you liked more. If you like my pickups more, just comment Grant or something like that. You guys get the idea. Thanks for watching the video, and also make sure to subscribe to my YouTube channel and follow me on Instagram. Yeah, down below. Links so. will be down below. Make sure to follow me too. I have been promoting SneakerCon Cleveland because I was planning to go, but due to the coronavirus, it has been postponed. So yeah, with the coronavirus, just stay safe out there. Make sure to wash your hands, clean your phones because you're touching your phones a lot. Both of our schools were canceled for two weeks. A ton of schools around the area have been closed and around the U.S. So just stay safe out there stay clean wash your hands everything like that with that being said that's the video we hope you guys did enjoy if you did please make sure to give it a big like subscribe to both of our channels if you haven't follow us on instagram we'll see you guys in the next one we're out peace much love all right so you're gonna say i'm gonna say we're here five from that and then you can say all right, yeah. all right ready what's going on guys it's grant and i'm back with another video. <laughs> oh my gosh all why right. every time What's up? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if you're gonna say like say what's good, like. here. I'll just say we're all right. Dope, 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 shop, shop. What's up, boys? That's going at the end. <laughs>